Oh, okay. I mean, it would it would piss me off. Four, five, five eggs. <laughs> we cleaned out the pantry and grabbed a bunch of old rice and barley and sunflower seeds and even just using it as scratch. <laughs> it works. Oh, and some raisins. Uh, what we got going on here is a uh, poultry netting, electric poultry netting. Um, I, I got it primarily for goats because we want to get some goats so that I don't have to weed eat. <laughs> and uh, I got poultry netting because I do want to run goats, but then also behind them I want to run chickens and, you know, they can both work together and do what they're supposed to do, be goats and be chickens. Um, what I did get was a Solar Stop 80, so 80.8 80 joules. Um, trust me, this is my first rodeo with these, so I'm not too deep, but I did do a little bit of research. I could have went with the, um, the place that doesn't have supplies for tractors, <laughs> but uh, Pr Premier One, I went with them because they had a higher joule solar uh, energizer and the price was pretty competitive. Along with this kit came a hundred foot of poultry netting, which is a uh, 12423. I think it has 12 horizontals and 42 inches tall and then three inch gaps, three inch spacing vertically. Uh, and this is a hundred foot and then I also got two 164 foot netting kits for the goats when I get those. But hundred foot, I wanna try that out. These chickens have not actually ever been out of their uh, run since I built this two years ago. So I think they're gonna, if they even come out, they're gonna be uh, pleasantly surprised if they do. So first time setting up the netting, let's go. So I did kind of look over the instructions last night. Uh, site preparation, they want you to mow. It's not too tall around here on the other side, maybe unroll it. That went pretty well, check. Um, insert the beginning post. So yeah, the first post has some strings attached to it. I'm gonna use that to tie off to the uh, structure here, to this fence. They say keep two inches away. That way uh, it doesn't ground out and lose voltage. So I think I can, I think I can do that. another world out here. Yeah. No longer just shadows on the cave wall. So these, my first impression is, uh, it's just a really heavy duty stake. I wonder, I think it's, it doesn't seem like it's fiberglass. It's, I'm not sure what it is. It's just pretty strong. And I guess you put it in, in certain places and it just gives it some rigidity, kind of pulls back a little bit on the fence. So let me give it a try. See what I, see what I can do. Well, fence is up. That actually was pretty easy. I mean, how hard could it be? Just push some stakes into the ground and uh, pull it tight. This is one thing that I'm slightly concerned about is it's sitting on top of the grass here. I'm just wondering if every time I put a fence up, I have to like weed eat along the fence line. Uh, like I said, this is my first time. So if there's anybody out there that has uh, fencing experience, please, please tell me. I just want to learn. That's all I'm here to do is learn. Yeah, a little bit of grass touching there. I know it's going to lower the voltage. I just don't know how bad or what the problem's gonna be, but I guess you learn by doing, right? Slight sag in it in places. I don't know if that's an issue. I mean, I could pull it tight, but then I might as well put in a real fence in that sense. Um, 
That one there you can kind of see kicked out. I left it. It uh, seems to work pretty well. I put in these posts here. I think I'm doing it right. Again, give me some constructive criticism. It's going to be a learning experience for you. Another one. She's kind of lazy, so that doesn't matter. And then the chickens, they're going to they're going to learn a lot. Okay. I think the fencing is good. I'm kind of curious if that has to go all the way in. I guess we'll find out. Hook that up to there. And then they say uh, due south. That way. And then connect it here. Okay, it's not on yet. Chickens. I'm just gonna open the gate. And let you decide what you want to do. You ready to learn, Massey? Yay! <laughs> It's arcing on the grass here. There you have it. Um, my initial um, impression is it's a pretty good system. I mean, some wire and posts and some extra posts and a charger. I think it works pretty well. The only thing is I kind of want to see how strong it is. So I guess uh, I kind of have to, you know, like, the police officers have to get sprayed with uh, pepper spray to know what they're in for, so I guess it's time to get a taste of my own medicine. Ah, oh, it's not bad. Ah, <laughs> you could feel it, but it's not. Oh, okay. I mean, it would it would piss me off. <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't keep touching it. That's for sure. Huh. Well, they're out, so. Two of them at least. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. figured it out. Is she gone? <laughs>